spring showers always bring beautiful flowers. Hey, how's it going everybody? The Genuine Fur here again. And today, in, on this beautiful, muggy, kind of cool uh, Thursday afternoon, I believe it's Thursday, we are in Brasstown, North Carolina. And going to work every day, I've always driven past Brasstown, North Carolina for years and years. I've always driven past here, but uh, never took the opportunity to, you know, just kind of stop and look around and see all the different shops that they have here because they have quite a few shops and quite a quite a few neat look, looking buildings. So. Uh, Uh, good old traffic. <laughs> but they have quite a few uh, neat looking shops and neat looking buildings. So um, I thought I'd stop in this afternoon on my way home and uh, check them out a little bit. So a lot of traffic today. But uh, so anyway, like I said, I thought I'd stop in and check it out a little bit. So if you'd like to join me, let's go ahead and start. Well, that's pretty cool. They got some art galleries here. And it looks like they've got some classes too. If you wanna learn how to do it yourself. Looks like they got some stained glass in there. And some pottery and some more traffic. <laughs> Some seats out here to kind of hang out and relax. Very nice, very nice. Anybody living in there? You got a neat looking house. I love the paint scheme of the buildings here too. Here are the hours of the shops. Looks like I just missed it today. If I was here about 30, 45 minutes earlier, I could have uh, checked out some of them. That's all right though, maybe next time. And if you enjoy farmer's markets, they've got one every Wednesday. That looks like a pretty happening spot up there on the hill. I'll have to try that out sometime. All these years that I've lived here, I didn't know there was a little restaurant up there. Hello, Mr. Carr. The famous Brass Town sign. So this is where all the big celebrities live? I could have sworn that was a little further out west. I don't know. They've got all the buildings painted up nice here. Doesn't matter the size, big or small, we'll have you looking nice. And just down the road here, we've got the John C. Campbell Folk School. I did a video of that uh, back in last fall, around October or so. So if you wanna check that video out, uh, I'll leave a link to it in the description of this one. And of course, a tour of Brasstown, North Carolina wouldn't be complete without checking out Clay's Corner, the site of the world famous Possum Drop. Now I know they, he held the Possum Drop here for many, many years, but in these last few years, I don't think he's done it here anymore. Actually, I don't think, I'm not sure if Clay owns this corner anymore, owns this little building anymore. I could be wrong. If I am, please correct me in the comments below. And I'm not sure if he's, and <laughs> I'm not very informative. And I'm not sure if they still do the possum drop anymore. Also let me know. Here's that art gallery I showed you in the beginning of the video from a different angle here. Got some seating area on the side.
Here's another one of the little shops here. Man, what is with the traffic? That is absolutely crazy. I didn't realize there'd be that much traffic here. Interesting displays here. Well, that explains a lot. There definitely are some oddities in there. Check this out, guys. They even have some antiques. I love checking out all this old stuff. I really do. I wonder how old that scale is. There's another shop on the other side of the road there. You can spend all afternoon here if you wanted to. Or morning. Depends on which one you prefer. And how the weather's doing. Now that is really cool. An old-fashioned service station equipped with old-fashioned gas pumps. Contains lead. That really dates it. And the 42 cents a gallon <laughs> dates it pretty bad, too. Oh, if only we could get gas for 42 cents a gallon again. Well guys, that is gonna do it for today. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, be, hurt, be sure to hit that big thumbs up below it. Let's me know I'm doing a good job. And if you haven't already and you'd like to, feel free to subscribe to my channel. And until next time, I will see you guys later. Take care.